Okay. Our next topic will be Ugupath. A lot of people have spoken about Ugupath. A lot of people have said a mouthful about Ugupath. Yay! What I'm going to say is to add to what they've already said, right? I'm not saying what they've said is wrong or right. I'm just adding to what they've said. Ugupatha is very important. For me, you start by fetching the, those spirits. You fix that part first of the spirit. And then because you fix them, now you need to to speak to them. Now that you have brought them home, the language that you are going to use in speaking to them, then we say, How do we pasha? Is partnering the same with everybody, all the nation? Is it the same? No, it's not. And uh, how come we are not telling people that you cannot partner like this or go back home and check how are people partnering in your home? Don't copy what the mutuas are doing for Ugu Pasha because it may not work for you. You could copy what I do and then you get beaten up by your ancestors. Or your things, they don't work up well because you copy it. I remember, <laughs> just to, to deviate a little bit, I remember twasas, you know, when people are twasaring and they're in the same school and the, the, the gobela is very harsh, a ama twasa will end up lying, right? We know that. And this twasa was like, hey, I dreamt. I, because the other one, when they kneel in front of the gobela and then they talk about their dreams, and then this twasa was also copying the other twasa's dream and say, I also dreamt about that. It's, focus on yourself. Don't be pressured. Don't be pressured in doing things the way other people are doing it. Focus on your lineage. Focus on doing what you If you don't know, it's okay to go back home. It's okay to go and get that person who's, who's got the similar same name like you. Because these same names, they are, all, they are the same, right? If, let's say, Ngungumutwa, there's somebody else, Umbembezi. There's somebody else, Umsweli. There's somebody, we are Mutwas. Ukpasha wetu will be the same. So Ukpasha needs you to understand first what is it that at home, how were they pashering? It may happen that you grow as a healer or you grow as an individual and you are called that by different countries to come and pasha for, for them. You need to know, let's say, for example, I go to, to, to Zim, for instance, because my aunt used to stay in Zim. I need to know when I enter Zim, how are people in Zim doing for Ugupatha? Benza, Ganjani. I cannot come with my own knowledge and my own tools of Ugupatha and think I'm going to impose my tools to, to Zim. I always tell people that go in there and do a baseline survey, a mini baseline survey for that country and know how are they doing things. Usually in Zim, I have a sister, we love partnering together. Every time I was asking her, like, this sister, when I talk about Ugu Pasha, she carries nothing except the snuff. She always carries a snuff. When you say, sister, please let's partner, she'll take out her snuff. She's always ready, I love her. She'll take up, out her snuff. And I was asking myself, yes, even though I been in Pepo, but she will partner using a snuff. That's what she was taught at home. I needed to respect that. If I was a bully, I was like, no, we are passing the mutuals use this one. No. People from Zim, 
usually because I'm, I've traveled Africa, I've seen a lot of things. They partly using snuff. They also partly using water. So it's not okay to impose on people and say, who partly ganji? You'll make people sick. You, you, you know what? There are other ancestors that, that are so hard, they can even kill you because you are, you are communicating with them using the wrong network. It's the wrong network you're trying to talk to me. That network is not cutting it with me. And then you ask yourself, how come they are not hearing me? I've been partnering for quite some time. This thing is not happening. Is the way you partner corner the correct way? And you also have other countries that are only using rice. Yes, they don't use in people. And uh, if, if, if you are like me, you know everything about it. Pashari, you see that person, maybe you're like, okay, how come, how come this one is, maybe the person will ask for rice. They're like, okay, now you want to finish my food. Do you need rice for Pasha? No, we Pasha with them people here. Mm -mm. Respect people. There are communities, there are nationalities that use different tools for Ugupasha. Sometimes it may happen that you are a healer and you, 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 you help these people. You need to understand what are people using out there. You cannot box yourself in one thing that you know. Because I can come into your initiation school and then bring Fugitos Lama Koisen. I need a question in Bepo now. You'll bring them and the 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 abangoma in Bepo. There's also in Bepo abangoma, or you'll also bring in Bepo the one that is used in Asia, the white one. And you want to paint it for me, and then I become wild. And you ask yourself, how about it? I'm burning in Bepo for her. How come she's not connecting? You are using a wrong tool. You are trying. You've got a great heart. You are trying to help me but you are using a wrong tool. There are also countries that use, I, other people, they, they'll tell you about candles. Hey, don't impose on people. There are nationalities that don't even use candles. Let another, with, with my father, another, I, I, I like quoting Baba because I've learned a lot from him. My father, when he, he does Ugupasha, you'll see Baba making a bonfire. I'm like, okay. And then this old man now is doing bonfire and he's talking, talking, it's so hot. He's even darker than before now in this fire because that's the way Khoisen used to Pasha. They will make a bonfire and then they will put Impe Poyama Khoisen inside that fire, and then they will dance around the fire to evoke the spirits of the Khoisen. So Ugupatla is totally different. And then you also go to, to, to the other countries, like the, the, you go to, let's say you go to a, a, a Zambia. I know Baba has been to Zambia to go to conferences there, and he was asked, and I, I happened to be there at some point, seeing how Ugutiba Pasha Ganjani. They Pasha differently as well. They don't use Impepo. They don't use candles. They do it in their own Zambian way. You go to Swaziland, they do it differently. You go to, to, to Kenya, they do it differently. So Ugupasha, look, we need to be sensitive with people when they pasha in their own way. Let me make another example. Like in, in, in our initiation school of, of training students to become healers, right? When I pasha in in my space, I will partially using the mutua tools of Ugupath. 
But when as it was, when you go home, you are not supposed to imitate my partnering unless me and you got similar surname or whatsoever. You need to partner in a way that at home they taught you. You partner in your in your you follow your lineage, how they were doing things. Because sometimes you you go home because you know you know sometimes we come we become um the matosas will love you so much that they can even imitate each and everything that you do. Mm. They can even imitate even your partnering mm. because you are such a role model. Yeah. If I can partner like Isis, that means I've got it. Mm -mm. When you go home, you use Isindo, the tools. As a say, as a park. If at home they are using water for Ugupal, use water for Ugupal. Nowadays, a lot of people, I've been hearing when it was locked down, people were frustrated that there was no snuff. Hey, how am I going to butter? There's no snuff. <laughs> Is that the only tool that they are using at home? Is snuff pen? Because as, as, as Africans, we've got different tools. We are given different tools. We are not only given one. But people were so stressed out with snuff not being there for Ugupal. May they were partnering using water, they were partnering using rice, they were partnering using millimil, because there are other nationalities that only use millimil. And if you help me, you cannot tell me with partnering a millimil, unjelimil. You need to find out from me and say, Ekaya, what are you using for Ugupal? And it's up to me to go and do that research. It's not the healer's work to go do that research for you. As individuals, we need to know our lineage. Those things are very important. They are very important. So I think that's that in a little bit, and let's, let me take questions to add in whatever that people are asking. Uh, thank you, Gogo. Um, I just wanted to recap in terms of what you've just said. Um, what are the learnings that, that, I'm, that I'm gathering is that it is important to do your research in terms of your lineage. Know yes. who you are. Know thyself, you know. Yes. Know how to communicate with, you, with your ancestors mm -hmm. and know, the, know how to use the correct tools, you know. And also, there's a few there's a few questions that were raised in my mind as you were speaking, is that uh, the significance of impepo? Yes, not everybody will be able to use impepo, but I'm seeing that in a lot of religions, and uh, not just Africa, as Abantu, Abawantu, is that impepo is features everywhere. You see the Muslims they use impepo. You see in India they use impepo, and you see all these other cultures and and, and various religions, even the Catholics. They use impepo, the importance and the significance of impepo in as much as we partner differently, but it seems like it's a common denominator. Yeah. And then the, and the, another question that was raised in my mind is that what happens, this comes at the backdrop, is that when I went to a different country, impepo leet was not there, you know, and what happens if you don't have the correct tools? That to use for upatla, you know, uh, what what do you, does that mean now that you can't patla, you can't communicate with your ancestors? How how would that work? Um, and how do you recognize the last part is that in as much as we can say hey patla and we can all be all, be all spiritual and whatnot, how do you then as an individual know what there is an issue la pa imsamo la patla kono or wherever at your shrine because you can sit there you might find that you're using the correct tool uh, but there's a problem with your ancestors that needs to be recognized sometimes it might be but then how do you then recognize actually there's something wrong in, in, in some mm -hmm. way, the shrine that you're praying at okay my course uh, if you are not carrying your correct tools for Ukupatla, I'll look at you and like, whoo, shame on you. 
because when you go, you plan. It goes back to planning, right? It goes back, back to planning. I know that I need to be traveling. What is it that I put into my bag? Like, I, I know that I'm, I'm bothered a lot by ancestors. Sometimes they, they don't want to speak. They, I always, in my small bag, I carry impepo. I carry impepo zangoma because mutuas are, a lot of them are healers. I also carry impepo that was loved a lot by my father, the Catholic impepo, Ubaba love, that's impepo. So I put it in the in the bag. I also, because my mom loves snuff, I put it snuff. When I communicate, they will tell me, okay, use this one for now. Always when you travel, be ready with things that you will need. Don't assume, don't relax. We, we, we are living in a world where let's plan better. Let's plan better. But again, if you have nothing, it's okay to just kneel there and talk to them. You can look for a tree and say, Eba fetch, because I guess we believe Uguti by Ituta. We believe Uguti, they can hear you wherever they are. You tell them, but I messed up, I've forgotten to bring your bepo, this and this and that, but could you please be here with me? Mm -hmm. As long as you can tell them that you've forgotten things, they will hear, they will hear. You don't have sometimes to beat yourself and say, oh, I'm not bepo, so oh, no pasharing today. No, you can, you can just sit like this. Mina, what I do, I can have conversations with them. I have conversation with my ancestors over tea and say, Bafetu, today, I, I'm not burning your thing because when I burn it, I get sick. Today, let's have a cup of tea. Having a cup of tea with your ancestors. Let's go today, we are going for a swim. Let's go for a swim. Please protect me. Hey, I will drown. I'm afraid of water. You just, you, you make them your friends. Mm. And also, you, you, you are talking up, you asked about e, 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 how do I know if, come, could you please repeat that? How do I know? So that I say, how do you recognize that there is something wrong in your shrine or in Samo or wherever, like La U Kulega Kona, or there's something wrong in your bloodline, you know, mm -hmm. that when you're partnering, you're actually invoking other things, like if, let's say, this is just an example of some yeah. of the things that could be wrong, or it could be something else, you know? Mm. Mm. You know, if, if, you, if your ancestors are clean, um, is clean, you, they, they will come for you. They will come for you. Because remember, when you have fetched them, you have fetched them correctly. Now, more partial, you've got the correct tools. You'll see signs, like as I'm sitting here, right? I'm seeing a I'm seeing a bee. There's a bee inside this house, right? I know that. Okay, if I see a bee, somebody is coming. There are small things that ancestors will show you. It's just that we are too busy to recognize things. Sometimes it may happen. Uguti, M Samo, maybe you'll have a lot of ants. Or ube ube gube gube some different smell that you'll, you'll, you'll smell in, 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 in some, you'll know that there's something wrong. Or even your dreams, because we get tired, we, we, we forget our dreams. But every time when you dream, when you wake up, write your, your dream down. You will know ancestors are so diligent in small matters. They will show you. I believe I've been shown a lot of things. It's easy. They, they show you as long as um some right. They they show you. They they speak. You hear them. You don't have to be a mutua to hear them. Everybody, there's no big or small ancestors. Ancestors are the same. But you hear them if you are focused. It's just that we are too busy to listen. You need, I like what we did when we started the breathing exercise. It's very important. The meditation. You need your alone time so that you can hear these voices. You know, one day, just sharing again, I visited this other healer. We were sitting in the healer's uh, in Samoa, okay, you know, the, uh, the mutuas also banabalozi, right? So now this ancestor yabalos. So I'm hearing in my head, I'm like, mm-hmm. 
I'm afraid to tell this this healer that hey, I'm hearing things in Samoa. Huh? But there was that thing inside of me that say, say something. Jay. Jay. <laughs> I ended up telling her that, hey, Gogo, uh, um, you know, I'm feeling about lousy. Learn some more. <laughs> Coco was so grateful. Uti, I'm sitting there visiting. It's been long since she has had Abalos, but now at least somebody who's a friend can feel it. So you need to you need to know on how to to be sane. Be sane when we deal with the things of the spirit. Unga pap. Baba will say unga zo pap. Just be saying, just align yourself. I know that now I'm touching the subject. These people are sensitive people. I need them. They need me. For them to function, they need me. So mm -hmm. allow them to use you. But you need to focus. You constantly need to cleanse yourself. You constantly need to, to align yourself. You constantly need to chase away the bad spirit. And you, you constantly need to go to that healer and go check. Other people, you just need to go to that healer and go check. That is why you have healers, right? They'll throw bones and check what is happening with you, and they'll tell you what to do. And mm. mm. I, I, you know what, Gogo? I feel a, a comfort in terms of Uguti, the, the, especially if you don't have the correct tools, because some of our tools are forbidden in other countries. Um, mm. In the Middle East, it's not mm -hmm. going to happen. Mm -hmm. yeah, you will yeah. be arrested. Mm -hmm. It's not going mm -hmm. to. So even I when know. you go to such countries, you mm -hmm. you you feel comfort to know Guti. It's not the only go-to uh, thing. You can still communicate with your ancestors even when you don't have a mm -hmm. web, You know. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um. So we've got another question from U Usiza, and mm -hmm. she says Guti. Should one trust the process they feel is the one, especially because most blacks are lost in Christianity and the white world? How important is it to listen to your dreams? The most confusing thing in our time also is the false processes and prophets. Izangoma Ezekila Abant. And then she has a second question, Gogo. <laughs> are there any other are there any alternatives for people in urban spaces to practice or to bridge the gap? in our spirituality, e.g. can you have Umsamo in a rented home? <laughs> yeah, you need to tell Mustang, would you must stand can I please you need to ask because when you rent somebody's you when you rent somebody's space, the ancestors of that place, right? If I rent your home, I will when I come, the first I will tell you who am I. I'm no Zippo Mutua. I believe in this. Can I please have my corner, Lapungizo Pasha corner? Because you don't want to shock my stand. Next time my stand will come into your room and my stand will see in Dwanguza Kolapiana and then my stand will say you are a witch. You want to take his house. Yes, you can have Umsamo Wako in a rental place. But another thing, if you don't have Umsamo, there are other options that you can do. You can go outside your path and a pant. But just check, is it in line with my lineage? You can go with your path a manzin. Abanyabantu, they can go to the sea by your path come. But check, are you aligned with logo path logo? You don't want to path guma wrong spaces. And I, I, I say I like her. So you can do that. You can have Umsamo, but you need to communicate with the ancestors of this house. It's very disrespectful. So be Umsamo wa kola piana and then minangaz. I think it's disrespectful. You need to tell me, Uguti. Yes, even though you pay me because they are ancestors of this house. Things that you believe in, I need. So that I can also support you. And tell also tell a much was like I would see no ban no ban no ban. It depends again would see where you're renting. It depends where you're renting. If you rent the backyard, must stand is inside, tell must stand. But if you rent a flat, 
you don't owe anybody any explanation. You put him somewhere wako. We have parallel. There's nothing wrong with it. Um, I think the other question, Gogo, was um, whether, uh, uh, like, um, let me just go back to it quickly. Is um, if you when you parallel, you spoke about using the correct tools and using the correct processes, and in a sense that. Um, how do you then know do you just go with what feels because it, we like it it does tend to happen when you feel like hey i'm trying i feel like we're putting light to maharaj or today i feel like we're or do you have to wait for a dream to come to you in a sense Uguti, this is the correct way your path how, mm. how does that then work in terms of finding out the correct way your path because mm. it might be Uguti, they use in your 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 path, but because of historic reasons within your specific bloodline, you can no longer use that process because it invokes something else. How does that work, um, Gogo? Mm. I think people are more focused on dreams. We are being told things by our ancestors, not only with dreams. You'll find that somebody is supposed to become a healer. That person will only wait for a dream and the dream doesn't come. You'll wait forever. So true. Sometimes it does happen that you see visions. You must also be aware of being able to see visions. A vision, let's say I'm sitting like this, I'll be seeing, hey man, at first you are shocked and like, hey, what's that? That thing, if they want your attention, it will becoming most of the time. It's not only ipupo that you need to, 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 to be serious and say, I'm pupil. No, you must see the visions that happen. Sometimes like for, 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 for instance, the one that I'm saying of, of Uktwasa, let's say for example, you wait for, for ipupo to come for you to go to Asa. But you've been, it has been putting this person next to you. Every time you you cross this person, you, you come across this person, you go, I man, I, 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 get, I get worried. I worry. I constantly see you in my space and I'm like, you are not there, but most of the time I'm there, I'm like, there's something that the ancestors are teaching me about this person. What is happening? What is it that I need to learn from this person? There's something, and then I'll start talking to you. You'll find out that that person is your gobela. You'll find that that person is your gobela, but you didn't dream about the gobela. It came in a vision. So you need to, your aerials, they need to work. We work so hard, we get tired too much. We, we only focus on dreams. We don't, we, I, I wonder who said we mustn't focus on our visions. I wonder who came up with that. Because these two, they, they go hand in hand. So it's very important also to, to tap into your vision and see if it's okay. Okay. And also feel it. You'll feel it. You know, there are things that you feel. It's just that you are too distracted. We feel things. Maybe if you don't feel now, but when you're home, like, you reflect. I don't know. Maybe it's me who like reflecting. When I'm home and I'm sitting I'm like, Nelly, Nelly said this. You know, I like reflecting. And like, oh, oh, that Unel was answering that. So it's very important to be simple and understand that this is what is happening. And what? if the ancestors don't want you there in the vision, maybe you, you see me because I'm wearing this to be like, ah, I've been seeing ISIS. If the ancestors are not cool with us, they'll take you out. They'll remove you from ISIS. They, they've got their way because sometimes too, you'll find that I, th I think it's a vision, but it's not. And then the ancestors were like, not this one. Wait, be patient. There's one thing about us, people who are doing spirituality, we are so impatient. We are so impatient. You go to this healer, maybe let me, things that people do, you go to this healer, I love this person, da, 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 that we are giving medicine. You want things to happen now, 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 now. Sometimes things, they will take time. 
how I wish healers could say, be patient. Be, because if you're not patient, you'll end up doing wrong things. You'll end up taking things that are a quick fix and that are not sustainable. Be patient. And also know on how to communicate with your trees that you are given. Of course. Yeah, you've highlighted something which is very, very important. Um, the importance of spending time um, by yourself and just to reflect. And it, now that we've also touched on e dreams, I think it, it, this question, this what you just said, leads us to the next point of our discussion, uh, which is Amabai. That you, the, okay. in terms of what you, what the, the the lineup that you just said that that you yes. provided us at the beginning of our discussion. Of course. Yeah. So at least now we we are aware that you cannot only focus on a dream. A dream is very important. It's also visions are very important. You see visions, you 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 dream. So never ever ever try to focus on one thing because our ancestors have order. They give you plan A and then they give you plan B. But we choose to take plan A only. No, let's also tap into plan B and see if plan B works, right? So we are given tools. Okay, this issue of Amabai has been has been bothering me a lot. It has been bothering me a lot. I look around like when you see here, I love Amapai, but I'm very specific with what type of Ipai I use, and there are reasons for that. Let me just explain about the Bai that I use now that you can see the Lion Bai, the Lion Bai, the Lion Bai. One day when I was sleeping, I dreamt it was, it was, um, I was graduating from being a healer. It was in a dream. I was graduating of of being a healer, and then my 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 great grandfather came to me, and then one father is kumba, is kumba the lion. Hey, me. <laughs> Uh, sometimes I'll throw things, hey, don't, I don't like people touching my shoulders. <laughs> I'm, I'm very sensitive. So one father is Kumba, say, 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 lion. And I ask Mkulu, why are you giving me this? Because, you know, when, like, I'm a mutua, Ubaba was given a tiger. I was expecting that even with me, in line with Ubaba, I will be given a tiger skin or I will give I will be giving it by a tiger but it's different it was in they are looking at the the all these what do we call them the animals the lion the tiger the mina they are giving me the lion the big five I think that's the cool. big five thank you so much <laughs> mina they are giving me the lion Obaba, they gave Obaba ingwe. My sister was given a crocodile. The other one, they were giving elephants. Each and every one of us, we are given different animals. And there are reasons for that. And there are, we need to respect what you are given. When you use Ipai, just like Isambat, it's very important to officiate that. After they have given you this material, it means nothing if you haven't been, if you have been partial for this buy. It means nothing. You can do a drippy suit about it. <laughs> you know, it means nothing. You buy, you put on nothing. But once you take this here that you are given, I am. Uh, you go, we spoke about you, okay, you, you appreciate that they've given you this animal. You go to your 
thank you for giving me this animal. There's a reason why they are giving you that animal. So if I can just go and take all the mapais and and put it and put those mapai in myself, what if they kill me? And you are messing up. You are messing up. Because when uh, you see Isis using the, the, the lion mapai, you think, oh, she's cool, she looks sweet. Let me use them. But you, you, you'll block your ancestors. Your ancestors want to give you greater things. But now you take, you do things on your own. You are not giving your ancestors a chance to give you things. Ancestors, they will give you. Let me, let me also explain another thing about e calling. A lot of people, they've been talking about e calling. Why, why are we caught? Why do you call me? You know, I always tell people that I didn't want to be caught. People are like, ah, I hated to be caught because I know it's painful and it's hard. Mm. If it's painful and it's hard because not only it's going to be painful, people are thinking the pain is the pain when you are with the Gobelas, you are in Gobelas house. Pain starts with your life. With me, they told me, until you take the calling, you're not going to have children. So I was like, okay, no children. That means I can go and dance. Don't relegate to the wings. I'm happy. <coughs> you know? But that was very painful. As you grow, you wish you could have a child. E calling is not easy. As they call you, also, our ancestors are so orderly. As they call you, they also give you tools. They call you because they entrust you with their work. These ancestors, they know their story. They don't just call anybody within the family. Maybe you ask yourself, how, how come they are not calling Nambita? How come they are not calling Usizwe? But they are focusing on me. That's what I, I used to ask myself. That I, I have my brothers who are smart. I have my cousins who are driving that car. Hey, go call them, not me. Isis want to go and work with children there. Isis want to go there. But ancestors are so specific. They entrust you. They know that if they give you this, you'll handle it with care. And if you don't handle it with care, they feel so much pain. And if they feel so much pain, they'll come, they'll come for your head. So they call you because they trust you. I want to, to, to also go back to the Mapai. Let me take it a little bit up. They call you because they trust you. And as they call you, they'll also give you tools. Let me give you tools on how to help people. They will give you tools. I call them tools. They will give you tools. Other ancestors, they will give you a tool. Tap into that knowledge inside. They are not giving you anything but to shine on a card. Other ancestors, they'll give you tea. When, when your client come inside the house, when your client come inside the house, and then your, your client, you ask your client to go pour tea for herself. Please feel free in my house, you can pour tea for yourselves. They pour tea and then you, they drink the tea, the A.N. in Gambi, and then you upula using the tea. Other ancestors, they'll just give you the person itself, like mbule izan. You look at these lines that I have here, upula umuntu using the lines that are in your hands. Those are some of the tools your ancestors will give you, but you need to be focused. Because if you copy somebody else, you'll end up not knowing what your ancestors are giving you. They'll give you the hands. There are so many ways. 
Sometimes I struggle just to see people want to bula with femba pale. Yes, we want to femba, but what if I'm not giving femba? What if I'm giving ugupula gamans? I take you to the sea. I remember this other healer was like, I, the, the seas are talking to me. I take guys, when you come to me, I get it. We are so used that when you take people to the sea, we are going to cleanse them. But you find out your ancestors are saying, when as they come, you must you must plan your 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 your, your timetable better. You take them to the sea. So ancestors are so vast in knowledge. I'm so happy to to be in their space because I know that they are they, they, their bags are heavy to give us different tools. To give right to give us different things, but we are so focused and imitating other people and end up being gimmick. Because focus a good lente yoto. If bonke ba pula ngamatambo, now we so full of shy ngamatambo. I've seen people the pure ngamatambo. Kote magati we are we are trita utogu tugu miyamezwe. But you need to to say ne na bagaban ban. Is this the tool that you want from me? Yes, when I left that school, they give me, but do you really want this tool for me? And then you'll see, it will come clear, but you also need to do a cleansing of the things that you use for, for Ugubula, like you cleanse your crystals, you cleanse your amatambo, you cleanse, you cleanse your, your, the things that you use for other people so that you remove their bad spirits, even though we need them sometimes, but they must be a little bit aside when you do other things. So the ancestors, they have order. They give you according to what they want from you. What I don't want to see is people imitating others. Even Amapai. There are Amapai that, that are meant for Abokoko, kuna mapai awabokoko, kuna mapai for for great grandfathers. Then we have amapai abazimili, the hunters. We also have amapai abonjeti that I use by the Ndau spirit kakul. We have amapai that I use by amanzuza amanono. We have different types of amapai. So what I want to say to people is that. Never ever imitate somebody. You are unique. You are unique. Use what the ancestors are giving you. Yes, you can use other colors, right? You have a lot of variety that use other things that are not spiritually connected. But when you have to speak to your ancestors, the back stands with you. You use the correct tools. You use the correct tools. Because we have the ones that uh, I was even thinking about the one Yaba One one person was saying, seeing seeing another lady wearing a uh, ipai eli 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 nyama. It's like when you see black. I don't know what what happened to a black color. Hey, I love black. Me, I love black. When you see black, you're like, yay! How come this one is using black? It's conditioning of us people. <laughs> Come again, Coco. I'm saying it's the conditioning in terms of how we have been taught that white is good and black is, it's much deeper. It goes into the yeah, colonization yeah. and everything. Mm, mm. It goes uh, back to Amapai. Yes, we have Amapai, Amyama, Amapai, Abo, um, Amapai, Abazingeli. Amapai Ama Hosana. We also have Amapai Aba Ama Hosana. The one Aba Zingeli is the one that that you see a lot of the Ama Zingeli Mapai in, in Zim. It, it, it's it's the red, those Mapai. Now I see a little bit of maroonish, but the ones that I know are red, the the they are diamonds, the, the inside they are diamond shaped, a little bit with a little bit of black. And also the Amapai Ama Hosana. You, they are, they are black. We have those those ancestors that love black. So when you see somebody wearing a black, there's a show that lady loves a black pie. I, I see it a little, I saw that show a little bit. I'm like, okay. If you know your things, you're like, oh, oh, okay. Immediately I understood why she used that black pie. 
because mm -hmm. ama by ama hosana lao a other hosana by is an ama dots so it's very important that don't go on the street wearing a lot of buys that you were not given by your ancestors because when you are given it by you need to officiate that buy you need to pass up for that buy you don't just get by from a chinese shop and then come where that buy and say and tell us that this is it by lamlelos lamlel me now will ask you did you officiate that if you didn't it's similar to somebody who can get his samba to everywhere and put less of samba to angazanga school again. So okay. each and everything that we use as healers, as we use as African people, it has a meaning. So we need to know what is the meaning behind this, what is the meaning behind that. It's up to us to go find out. Nobody's going to tell you, find out for yourself. It's homework. Okay. Uh, go, go. Um, Sesi Shiwa is Kati. Um, we need to wrap up, but I wanted to allow Tabang Mohale to um, ask his question. And uh, he raised his hand a bit earlier on. Um, and then there's one question uh, from Usiza, and then after we can wrap up, Usiza asked is that, is it important that every if you have the calling? And then I will allow now Tabang Mohale to ask his question. Tabang? Uh, can we please allow Tabang to to speak? He is unable to speak. He is on mute. He's not. Yeah. Yes. Does Tabang want, still wants to ask his question? Okay. Uh, we can proceed to uh, Caesar's question. Is it's about Salmonan, Salmonan, Salmonan. Uh, greetings, Salmonan. Salmonan. greetings, Salmonan. beloved. Salmonan. No, uh, am I audible? Yes, 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 I can hear you. All right. No, uh, how come um, is uh, guba no bunzima for umuntu kutayo twasa when it comes to imali and we don't have maybe imali yogu and to go Gubo Kobela and pay all these forty thousands and stuff. But now Amadlozi you are acting in the loom savings. And where do they expect me to to get the money? Like uh just in the simple yeah, umbuzo wa me Okay. Remember, thank you, thank you, Tabang. Is it Tabang, Caesar? Oh yeah, Caesar. Tabang or Kulumayo Oh Tabang. Tabang, thank you so much for this question. Uh, what I said is that listen to your ancestors. Idlozi will take you into somebody else's house and they have a plan. I've never heard somebody oye wa shona, shonela, even though maybe they, we, we do have, but they, 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 in terms of percentage in nane, oshonele idlozi ni because we are twasa. It was, will always have a plan of you. Once they take you out, I know that <laughs> other people have been, because me, I like planning a lot, right? So I was thinking, hey, this is not right for people just to go by your and my budget, you know? But it was, has a plan because you'll find out other people, even if you can have a lot of money, but when it's time for you to take their calling, they want you to be vulnerable. They want you to rely on them fully. They will take you there, ungana ngisho sent, but there's somebody that it was elizom toucher out there. You'll find somebody that you don't even know. Mm -hmm. Ati, can I please help this twas? Imenzele indozak. It was the order. It's us who are making it was in Italy. It was in the order. And uh, Tina, we are so impatient. We are so impatient. You go into Gobela's house, you are, you are timing yourself, ne? You are timing yourself. Because by Magpelunyar, I want to be out of this house. And it was, we will say, you wait a little bit for me to fix your stuff and get that person to come and help you. 
but you are so impatient because you want things done your way. Until things are done a dozy way, things will be okay. It was will never be to say, M's in a muntuling and a plane. Sometimes it goes, they, they, they even use the same gobela. The same gobela, you'll find out who gobela wako, even though I named those like, but at the keep them done, naming so patella, who humble your sevens, and then you'll pay me after. And then you think you go to gobela is, uh uh, gobela was used by your ancestors to say that, good, keep a humble your sevens a link home. And then, my sister, right, that person will come back. As long as you are consistent, right? So it was really in a plan, in a plan. Because sometimes it does not. Not everybody. Ukovela can put a price tag. Let me tell you about some cops that I know. Ne, cops can put a price tag. At me na, it was the same. I think it's another thing that we need to regulate. I know cops will kill me. Ukovela will say me na. It was twenty five thousand, only fifteen thousand, only ten thousand, right? And then what are you with you? Who comes at? It's okay, Danam. You can just give me two thousand rent and go work. But because you you came into God's house with the thing, what I've got it all, and then who comes and we're okay. We'll wait for Lona. What is one of the ones but you need to be humble when you go into somebody else's house. Just, just surrender. There's a song that I surrender all. Just surrender and allow the process to happen. It was, will always have a plan for you. They will never take you out of Kaya being on a plan. They will use anybody to come and help you. And it's up to you to listen and go back and say thank you. I'm a um, Goko, can you please answer the last question and then we wrap up for today's discussion. It's from Usiza. She wanted to know, Uguti, is it necessary for everybody who has a calling to go the Twasa route? I know you, you've spoken boldly <laughs> besides on this platform about, mm -hmm. about this, this particular topic. Um, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, my question says, no. It was not everybody who went on it was a twasa. Not everybody. Sometimes it was like nigga uguti, you must fix your family, your family menkin. So tina mas hamba siya go boko bella u so kala you go there with e language as a strategy. You are not giving your lozy a chance. It was, it will take you sometimes to go to, uh, 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 just go and ulungi sama puta enza baza albako. Sometimes you go 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 up, see, go up, see, does the cleansing, the cleansing, because when you go to a sari, you don't just go in uh, full force. No, there must be cleansing that happens. Yami, remove all these things that are here so that you know if you help me, gashe gashe unsiza guini. Not everybody on it was if I got you twice. Not every it was sometimes he has twice to sell. As I was sharing a little bit, but I mean, Elam, yes, I need a mentor. I need a mentor. It was like a mutolang twice. I'm sure not being prideful, but I know a lot of things that cops don't know. I'm not being prideful, I'm sorry, but I'm just sharing. It was sometimes they know what they want from you. They know what they want from you. So just give it a chance for it. And another thing that I want to share a little bit before we close, sometimes when you go to, to, to healers, see your, see your bula. remember you are not bullying your sickness. Ulungisa itonga lako. Ulungisa ilozi lako. Ilozi lako will bring in, let's say for example, ilozi lakamuto will bring in headaches. You have headaches. Besa, fane, mangi yopula, fane ke gulungi tongi. Maybe lifuna nchisi mpepo yari. Besa gulunga mina i headache. So sometimes we go to gobs and stay two hours, ne, like a consultation. When I do sessions for counseling, the standard is two hours or an hour. 
Sometimes you'll go your bula for 30 minutes. Best of all, this person I got shy call. I'm going to go fix it all. And then I'm done. You need to learn, you need to listen, because okay, as in is into they are not made by Okula Nani Itonga Yilo El Sueli Nulunis. So get somebody who will help you get a mentor. And if that mentor is not the correct, before you go out there and look for a mentor, please show me the correct person. Even when I go your Pasha first before Upuma Ekaya or your Bula. Tell your ancestors that I'm about to go and check this headache. Please be with that healer that I'm going to give that healer wisdom. We also Pasha for the healer, give the healer the wisdom, the insight, so that the healer, when they look at me, they see what is wrong with me. My course, let's do right with ancestors. Ancestors are. You call, call, they are smart. It's just that we want a quick fix. We want quick fix. Things of the spirit can be very slow and can be very frustrating. Marcos. Thank you so much. Like, I feel so, uh, so blessed um, to having shared the space with you. It's unfortunate okay. that it's Kati. Uh, I'm not even sure because I'm not Zulu. So, it's fine. <laughs> it's Nine I'm sure because I said that correctly, but we have run out of time and we've come to the end of our session. I so wish that we had more time. Definitely, Gogo, we need to bring you back to <laughs> these types of discussions. Wow. Um, with the Lozi willing, this will happen. This will definitely happen. Gogo, thank you so much for being in the space with me. Those are my glossy gangsters. You gave us the space, you gave us the platform just to share a little bit about what we've learned, what we've seen, what one in her years has been helping other healers to see this. Thank you so much. Much mm. appreciated. So where can people find you, Gogo, outside the space? Okay, please check Credo Muta Foundation. There's a, 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 a page there for Credo Muta Foundation. All the details are there. I is, also it have Facebook, it. is it Facebook or Instagram or is it both? Credo Muta Foundation? Facebook. I think it's, I, there's Facebook, there's Instagram. Yeah, there's, it's both. Also check me on my, on my, even though in my Facebook page, it's, it's a personal page, I, whatever that I, it's a debriefing page. I always tell people that if you think this person that you hear speaking here is a person that you see on my page, yeah, in trouble because my page is a space where I play. But for formality, check the Credo Muta Foundation page. Um, thank you everybody for joining us today. We have reached the end of our session. Please do join us again for next session. We will be entering into the season of UNEPTED. Um, exciting things are coming for that session. Please look out on our social media pages at It Can Be Natural Healing Social on Facebook as well as on Instagram and on YouTube. Please do follow us there and check out what we have in store for this season. Yes. Um, yes. Thank you.